Hey guys, it's me, Car Selector here, to do a review of the Sonic X Series 1 figures. And uh, I have Knuckles, Sonic, and Tails uh, by Toy Island. So, yeah, without further ado, let's start the review. So, first off, I'm going to start out with Sonic. Now, I'm also going to start out with detail. So, detail on Sonic. He. It. He's not really too good, but he's not terrible at all means. I mean, yeah, but the, uh, here, the sculpt is pretty bad. I mean, the eyes are inaccurate. The nose isn't really in the right shape. The grin is, well, the grin's okay. Uh, the quills aren't really that good. Um, they're not really representing how he does in Sonic X, anyways. Um, his back, his back spikes. Um, they're decent. His tail is not accurate. Uh, his stomach is, it's all right. Uh, his arms are a bit too, a bit too chubby. His gloves. They're all right, except this one's in a really weird pose. Um, the shoes are—they're decent in my opinion, except the um, you know the buckle is a bit too you know thin, and they didn't include uh, treads underneath Sonic shoes, and they forgot to color in. The back of Sonic shoes are white, so yeah. Um. Okay, yes. Yeah, so detail for Sonic, I'm gonna give him a six out of ten. He's not really that good, but he's not terrible in all means. But anyways, moving on to articulation. You can move Sonic's head 360 degrees. You can move his arms forwards and backwards you can actually move the this uh this arm 360 degrees if you can you know move the arm through the ear um you can move the legs 360 degrees same thing with this one if you just yeah and that's pretty much it for sonic so yeah if i was going to give sonic um, a score, I would give him a, a 6 out of 10 as well. Um, not really, there's not really a lot of, uh, possibility with this figure, but there is some, so yeah. Okay, next we're gonna move on to Tails. And, uh, yeah, the detail for Tails is... Well, first of all, the sculpt is not really good either. I mean... He's, first of all, he's too fat. Um, yeah, he's too fat. Um, his expression on his uh, face, it's just a really retarded looking expression, in my opinion. Um, yeah, he's got really awkward um, poses. But, yeah, anyways. Uh, besides that, everything's kind of kind of good, I mean, the eyes are, are alright, um, they got the, they gave the, they included the, uh, detail on the inside of his ears, that's pretty good, e that's pretty good too, um, the tails look, they look okay, um, they got the cuffs on both, both of his gloves and on his socks, and they included a gray belt buckle. Uh, that's pretty cool. Again, there is no treads underneath the shoes. Um, forgot to mention that, but anyways. Um, yeah, that's basically all I have to say for the detail on tails. So anyways, let's move on to articulation. So you can move the tails 360 degrees. It's actually, it actually winds up and makes a really annoying a, a 
So yeah, that's all I have to say for the detail and tails. So now let's move on to articulation. So for articulation, you can move tails' head 360 degrees. Um, you can move the arms forwards and backwards. Um, you can do the same thing with this arm. You can move his legs 360 degrees. Same thing with this one. And you can also move his tails 360 degrees and it winds up. But it makes a really annoying sound. Mine doesn't really work that well, but I guess I could give it a try. Yeah, it's going to make that sort of sound. And it gets quite annoying after a while, so yeah. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say for um, articulation. So, um, the detailed score on Tails, I'm going to give him a 6 as well. The uh, articulation for Tails, I'll give him a 6.5. Next, we move on to Knuckles, which he's actually pretty decent. So yeah, uh, the detail on Knuckles, um, the detail isn't really that bad on this guy. Um, the tail is, I guess it's okay. Um, he's a bit too chubby. They gave him the birthmark on his chest. That's pretty good. They got a really good Sonic Adventure 1-ish grin on knuckles um, the eyes are pretty decent as well uh, the nose is well sculpted the quill I mean the uh, dreadlocks are, are pretty good also uh, his, uh, his dreadlocks are made of a hard bendable plastic um, um, the the legs are well sculpted. The arms and the yeah the arms they're okay I guess. Um, the hands are a bit too big in my opinion. Uh, the uh, yeah the shoes are well the front of the shoes are ma are pretty well detailed, but again there still isn't any treads on. Knuckles whatsoever, and yeah, that's pretty much all the detail for Knuckles. So yeah, um, I'm gonna give Knuckles uh, for detail a seven out of ten. It's it's decent, and uh, yeah. Now let's move on to articulation. You can move the head only a bit though. Um, mainly kind of see so kind of can move the head left and right and it kind of interferes with the arms a bit you can move the um, arms up I mean forwards and yeah that's pretty much it same thing with this one um, it would go backwards if you know the dreadlocks weren't in the way um, you can move the legs backwards and forwards. Same thing with this one. And wait, hold on. Yeah, you can move uh, the right leg 360 degrees. And yeah, that's pretty much it for knuckles. So articulation for knuckles, I'll give him a 6.5 as well. So yeah, that wraps up Knuckles, and uh, yeah, let's take the time to re review the accessories. So the accessories are the Chaos Emeralds, if you got the uh, other release of these guys, you would get the keychains, which I already have. Um, anyways, here are the Chaos Emeralds, they'd come in either one of these colors blue, red, or yellow. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. It's not really a lot of detail on the emeralds, except they're kind of well sculpted. 
Um, anyways, yeah, time for the overall score. So overall, these figures are not too great. I don't recommend you pick them up. I recommend you pick up, like, any other Sonic line uh, besides this. Um, the sculpts aren't really too great. Uh, Knuckles is decent, though. Uh, the articulation is, I guess, okay for these figures. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna give these guys a... About a 6.5 out of 10. They're not too great. So, uh, so yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this review. And, uh, yeah, see you guys in the near future. Okay, bye.